Did you hear what happened to the woman when she was walking home with her baby last night? Do I have your attention yet? <laughs> this is why storytelling is a great way to firstly grab an audience's attention, teach them a thing or two, and have them remember the lesson in years to come. If you are a teacher or a manager who is tired of your students and staff not listening to you, knowing this will make your life so much easier. Even the busiest of people will stop to listen to someone's story. If you want your students, team members or staff to make time for training, trust me, threaten them with story time. A good story will transport learners out of the stuffy meeting rooms, offices or a classroom and into an adventurous world. When the audience is in that new exciting world, their mind becomes open to receiving and thinking in new ways. This is an ideal position from which to learn and receive new information and retain it. Storytelling is a fundamental way in which human beings process and share information. Stories stick. They organize the information in a way that helps us think learn and remember. They also evoke emotions, which is what burns into our memory, into our brains. <laughs> Not to mention, it's fun to listen to a story and watch Netflix. Stories can fuel understanding of all types of learning objectives, including math, science, history, social economics, and even teaching appropriate behavior and responses. In its simplest form, storytelling remains a powerful element of communication, with the narrative being equally as compelling as essays and textbooks. Except, unlike a textbook, presentation or pamphlet, they humanize the learning experience, which brings in the emotion and makes it relatable to the student. Narrative stories also put the viewer into someone else's skin. What better way to learn what it is like to be a police officer other than hear stories of one on the job through a documentary, a reenactment, or even an animation? The narrative story should have four elements, people, place, a problem, and the progress. Seeing the protagonist's adventure with whom they can relate should inspire and motivate the audience to take that path, learn those lessons, they will be inspired to win, just like the character. And when your staff or students are motivated by an external force, they no longer need to be persuaded and you can stop wasting your time nagging them and reminding them of something. Let the character do the work for you. There is something in the arc of the narrative, the quest that resonates with our mental makeup. Remember our croc brain that I spoke about a few vlogs ago? If the information in front of you doesn't serve your desire to survive or thrive right away, the brain will discard it. So, when you want your students or your staff to remember something, don't throw the meaningless numbers and facts that are disconnected to anything important to their experience right now. Don't lock them in a stuffy room with you droning on about something in a monotonous voice with a PowerPoint presentation, but rather, Create a world where they become a character embarking on a journey, where they just happen to learn about the history of the world's population or how to behave in a difficult situation at work. We are certainly in a digital age, which means you should be teaching through narrative film. That way you can make the lesson once and you can play it over and over again in different classes. Just press play and facilitate the discussion. Easy. If you really want to be clever, remember Choose Your Own Adventure books? Well, it's now possible to produce Choose Your Own Adventure films where you can select the answers to the lessons learned and reap the rewards or suffer the consequences. This takes learning to another story level as they are both emotionally engaged and actively participating. Whoa, both learning powerhouses together. This is unstoppable. Now, even though I believe we are all creative and all storytellers at heart, please don't try this alone, but call a professional filmmaker to come alongside you to produce a narrative lesson that can be used in a classroom for years to come. Good stories don't age, and that's the beauty of film. If you'd like to talk to me about helping you produce a narrative film with a lesson, please send me an email, I'd love to help. This is Dana, and see you next time.